Welcome to this YouTube channel. In this video we are going to talk about the top 10 most expensive wine collection in the world. Before starting this video like this video, and subscribe to our channel for future updates. Before we get into the topic of the most expensive wine ever sold, it's important to note, that the demand for high quality wine collections is at an all time high. Many wine collectors compete throughout the world for the rarest wines and most precious bottles, which are often hard to come by due to the different challenges of producing high-quality harvests. Although wine auctions were once primarily the domain of London-based auction houses, there has been a global change in the selling of wine at auction in the last 30 years. Following the 2008 recession, the pattern moved to New York, with Hong Kong wine auctions fast gaining traction. Today, wine auctions in London, Paris, Chicago, California, Beverly Hills, Hong Kong, and New York, to name a few, can be attended in person or bid on over the phone and online. Fine assets are constantly in high demand, as evidenced by the fact, that prices at auctions throughout the world continue to rise year after year. The top 10 most expensive wine collections are as follows. Number 10. Cheval Blanc Street Emilion 1947 $135,125. The Cheval Blanc Street Emilion 1947 is a wine legend, made up of half Cabernet Franc and half Merlot. Why? Because it triumphantly defies contemporary enology's laws. It's rich and porty, with a high alcohol concentration and volatile acidity. Everything that a fine Bordeaux should not be. The texture and flavor of the Cheval Blanc Street Emilion 1947, described by those who have tasted it as luscious and sensuous, is enticing. What makes it even more unique is that no other modern winemaker has the courage to develop a wine in this style. Number 9. Henry Jaya, Von Romane Croix Parentu 1999, $136,955. The Von Romane Croix Parentu 1999, produced in the heart of France's Burgundy wine, region costs $136,995. In the fall of 2018, it sat at the top of Christie's wine sale in Hong Kong. It's difficult to say if Henry J is worldwide, fame has raised this Croix Parentu to its current prized status, or whether it's the Von flavor Romanes of Timeless, appeal that's responsible for Jaya's international fame. Number 8. Chateau Lafite 1787 $156,450. The vintage Chateau Lafite 1787, dubbed the world's most expensive, normal, bottle of wine, is claimed to have come from Thomas Jefferson's cellar. The fact that his initials, THJ, are inscribed into the glass, as well, as his well-known love and passion for wine, support this notion. In 1985, publisher tycoon Malcolm Forbes purchased the Chateau Lafite 1787, which is now one of the world's most expensive wines. Chateau Lafite has a complex and long history. The name Lafite comes from the historic language term fight, which means mound or hillock, and refers to their plateau, which is one of the highest points in the appellation. Lafite's wine was sold in London at the beginning of the 18th century, and it was said to be a favorite of Prime Minister Robert Walpole, who was said to have purchased barrels from 1732 and 1733. After being introduced to the court at Versailles by Maréchal Richelieu, Lafite became renowned as the king's wine throughout France. Lafite is perhaps the wine with the best reputation for quality and longevity, among the five rarefied first growths, commanding correspondingly high prices. The other first growths, Chateau Latour and Chateau Mouton Rothschild, are both located in the Powerlac Appellation. Lafitte's 112 hectare vineyard is divided into three sections, the slopes around the chateau, the nearby Carouard's plateau to the west, and a 4.5 hectare plot in the neighboring commune of Saint Estiva, which has historically been admitted into Lafitte and hence the Powerlac appellation. Number 7. Ampoule from Penfolds minus $168,000. Each bottle of the latest version of Penfold's 2004 Block 42 Cabernet Sauvignon costs $168,000 while a glass costs $850. Unlike most of the others on the list, these ampoules are entirely commercial releases from South Australia's most famous winery, Penfold's. They don't have a cork, screw cap, or any other form of seal. The wine tasting is an adventure in and of itself, as the ampoules, which come in a glass prism container and a wooden cabinet, can only be opened by breaking off the end. A senior winemaking staff member will accompany the buyer to their location to assist them. The Cabernet Sauvignon ampoules from Block 42 are the most expensive wines available for purchase directly from the winery. Number 6. 
Chateau Margaux $1787-225,000. This antique wine, bearing the initials of none other than Thomas Jefferson, met a tragic end. Jefferson was a well-known enophile who frequently purchased bottles from Bordeaux and Burgundy while serving as ambassador to France. This bottle belonged to William Solokin, who paid $225,000 for it, and celebrated it with a meal at the Four Seasons Hotel. In addition, a waiter accidentally bumped against the table, shattering the bottle. While the insurance company compensated him, Solokin will most likely never be able to recover from the loss of a wine, that he was unable to sample even a smidgen of. Number 5. Chateau Lafite $1869-230,000. When this bottle of wine went up for sale in Hong Kong, it made quite a commotion. Auctioneers expected it to reach a modest $8,000, but to their astonishment, an unidentified Asian bidder took the top prize, $230,000. Many people in Asia consider the Chateau Lafite 1869 to be extremely rare, so bidders were willing to pay a lot of money to get one of the world's most expensive wines. Number 4. Shipwreck 1907 Hide Seek $275,000. Most people would find $275,000 for a bottle of wine absurd, but this wine has a highly unusual and intriguing narrative that clearly justifies the price. During the First World War, a ship transporting the wine was torpedoed by a German, submarine causing it to sink to the ocean's bottom for over 80 years. In 1997, the wreckage was found, and 2,000 bottles were saved. Even if you can't drink it, $275,000 buys you a piece of history, and a great story to tell at dinner parties. Champagne has long been regarded as the most prestigious of all wines and, dare I say, spirits. This interesting story about the 1907 Hyde Seac elevates this bottle to new heights. The lucky proprietors of this magnificent find have a rare piece of delectable history in their possession. After all, who can say they own a bottle of excellent champagne that has been preserved and aged in the chilly waters of the Gulf of Finland for almost 80 years? At the very least, one person is capable. Number 3. Cheval Blanc 1947-305,000 The 1947 Chateau Cheval Blanc is ranked third on our list of the most expensive wines. It was sold at auction to an unidentified buyer for $303,375, and is regarded as the greatest Bordeaux ever made. Chateau Cheval Blanc is regarded as one of the most prestigious producers in the world, having received the coveted Premier Grand Cru class, A, level in the classification of saint Emilion wine in 2012. The current Cheval Blanc vineyards were previously part of Figiac, but two large pieces were sold to the Ducasse family in the 1830s. In 1852, a Ducasse daughter married Jean Lausac Forco, and the family, whose name developed into Forco Lausac through the years, owned and maintained Cheval Blanc until it was sold in 1998. The wines have long been respected, but it wasn't until the 1960s that they began to command prices equivalent to the Medoc first growths. The summer was scorching hot, with clear skies from early April to late October. The harvest at Cheval Blanc began on September 15 while temperatures were still above 35 degrees Celsius, and was expected to be finished quickly. These torrid conditions meant that Bordeaux wines, especially on the right bank, achieved atypically high natural sugar levels, resulting in opulent wines that in some cases lacked stability. The crop was generous. Number 2. Jeroboam of Chateau Mouton Rothschild 1945 $310,000. It's no surprise that this bottle of wine costs so much, because it comes from the vineyards of the world's wealthiest family. The wine is regarded to be one of the best vintages of the last 100 years, with symbolism on the label representing the victory of the Allied troops in World War II. If a bottle is out of your price range, why not try a glass for $8,631? Then I'll take two. Number 1. Screaming Eagle Cabernet $1992-$500,000. Americans are known for getting the finest discounts. The most expensive bottle of wine ever sold was produced not in Italy or France, but in America, specifically, Oakville, California. The wine has earned cult status as a result of its rarity and tiny production amounts. In 2000, a bottle of Screaming Eagle Cabernet Sauvignon 1992, regarded as outstanding, fetched an incredible $500,000 at a charity auction. This wine is aged in 60% new oak and is opaque purple in color. It smells like jammy blackcurrants and has a hint of wood. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comment section below.
If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.